Blue Origin, Virgin Galactic, Worldview, SpaceX, all are working to make space travel possible for everyone. Those trips to the edge of space cost more money than most have to spend. But if you want to know what it's like to be an astronaut without leaving the ground or shelling out thousands of dollars, well, now you can. KPRC2 space reporter Roseanne Aragon got to experience a unique and immersive exhibition that shows what life on the International Space Station is like. She is live tonight in Sawyer Yards near downtown with more on the infinite journey that you can take right here in Space City. Hi, Ro. Hi guys, the access you get here is truly incredible. It shows you the value of the International Space Station, a deep dive into how our astronauts live and work there. We take you into the experience and go one on one with the CEO who came from Canada to show us. You get these magnificent views of planet Earth from outer space. Life changing views from more than 200 miles above Earth. It's a moment to reflect and it's a moment for people to um, take a step back. This is the infinite experience. Three years ago, Felix and Paul Studios, um, a virtual reality studio in Montreal, sent up cameras to the International Space Station. Three years of 8K video turned VR tour, capturing the magnificence of the International Space Station. Virtually being there. I mean, it's as close as it gets to being there. Here at Sawyer Yards. Whoa, this is so cool. We take you inside. Right now, I see my hands, I see stars, and nothingness. Uh, the experience is built around six chapters. The intention is, to, is for people to go th from liftoff go into space, visit the International Space Station. I wonder what module I'm in. 60 plus orbs open up new experiences with input from astronauts. You get to live uh, what the astronauts are living basically. Crew members connect with each other and function well together because as you can see right here, we're constantly working right on top of each other. Immersive learning, the overview of humanity from a different light. There is some scientific and there is some industrial components to it as well. Then, that's amazing. A front row seat. I'm watching the astronauts do work outside the International Space Station. This is amazing. So the spacewalk was actually filmed in August of 2021. But that's not all. Wow, that was great. After the VR experience, three art installations. It's really meant to bring you back to Earth. Bringing visitors profound perspective. We're all living on this small blue dot in the middle of, of space and the immensity of space. Simply amazing, so meaningful. The astronauts called some of those views life-changing and they treated that camera like an extra crew member. So it's really a front row seat. This experience will be here in Space City until April 17th. Reporting live from Sawyer Yards, Roseanne Aragon, KPRC. Two. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Seeing what they're seeing and living how they live. That's just really incredible. Roseanne, were you like not nerding out when you had those VR <laughs> goggles on? Because I would have been like, oh my gosh. I saw things and I said, I've seen that go up. I saw that on a cargo mission. Yeah. You know, I saw these people. It was so amazing. Mm -hmm. You have to see it. If you love space, if you don't love space, you just have it's to see cool it. It's cool nonetheless. It's truly 